Welcome to this edition of Dental Connections, brought to you by Delta Dental of New Jersey, New Jersey's leading dental benefits company and its foundation. This series is designed to increase awareness regarding the connection between oral and overall health. Here is participating Delta Dental Pediatric Dentist, Dr. Susie Press. As parents, we try to protect our children from disease. But did you know that you might accidentally be passing harmful bacteria to your child that can result in tooth decay? The truth is, much like a cold, the bacteria in the mouth that causes decay can be transferred from person to person, parent to child. This happens when items contaminated with saliva go into a child's mouth. Oftentimes, this occurs through natural parental behaviors. A mom is out with her baby when the pacifier drops. Rather than give back a dirty pacifier, she cleans it in her mouth. The problem is that she's sharing saliva that could have bacteria that causes tooth decay. It's the same when parents share utensils with their young children. The bacteria are shared too. Bacteria also can grow as a result of your baby's diet. Poor nutritional habits like sugary drinks or treats can contribute to poor oral health even in babies. After all, babies are born without harmful bacteria in their mouths. Once the bacteria are introduced, children become much more susceptible to cavities early on, as early as their first tooth. As a parent, you have the power to provide a good example by maintaining your own good oral health, as well as limiting the amount of bacteria your child might get exposed to. Here's how. Avoid sharing saliva. Don't share utensils, cups, or food. Don't clean your child's pacifier by using your own mouth. Get into the habit of brushing your child's teeth morning and night. You can do this even before your baby has teeth. Simply clean the gums with a soft cloth. After teeth begin to appear, begin brushing teeth with a small, soft toothbrush without toothpaste. Then, clean the gums with a soft cloth. At age two, you can add a pea-sized drop of fluoridated toothpaste to the toothbrush. Remember to wipe the teeth when finished until your child can rinse and spit. Finally, have your children eat right for dental health. Limit sugary foods and drinks, including sticky foods such as raisins and fruit roll-ups. Never put your baby to bed with a bottle, or if you do, only put water in it. Your child should start regular visits to the dentist by age one. Talk to your dentist about how to continue good oral health habits throughout your baby's lifetime.